Hey guys, so um, I know today I am actually filming on my laptop, and I'm sorry about that, but I was going to, I was about to go film on my camera, but then I realized it was almost dying, and so I'm letting it charge now, but the thing is though, I don't know how long it's going to take to charge, because usually my camera takes a long time to charge since I was like almost totally dead, so it, could, it was probably be done charging like later tonight by the time I'm getting ready for bed and stuff, and I'm not going to be in the mood to do the video then, so I just decided just for today to, to do the video on my laptop. And then next week I will, uh, like usual, do it on my camera. But so just today, so bear with me. Um, so before I get to the What's in My School Purse video, I'm actually going to uh, quickly show you some new products I got from CVS. Just three hair products. And then I got some stuff from Bath & Body. So the um, first hair product I got from CVS, I needed a new uh, heat protector because mine ran out. And I heard this is really good from a lot of people. Have, a lot of people have been telling me this. It is the Trust My Heat Tamer Spray. And it's just a red and black bottle. And it actually works really well. Like, I felt like my hair was being protected because it looked less, like, it didn't look as bad as usual. Like, it looked more smooth and it looked like it was actually protected by this. So this really works and it made it feel good and look good. So again, the Trust My Heat Tamer Spray. And you just do a few quick spritzes. And it worked really well. Um, the next, uh, hair product I got, two, they're both from, actually the two next ones, they're both from John Frieda Frizzies. The first one is a leave-in conditioner because I really needed one. Um, and they just kind of like, ooh, sorry. Um, it just like kind of replenish, replenish, no, re-nourishes your hair. Um, and you just spray it on when you get out of the shower when your hair is like damp. And you just do a few spritzes and work it through your hair like with your hands. And, um... It, again, like, it worked really well. Um, it made my hair, uh, feel, I mean, like, you don't totally, like, see it, uh, like, um, you don't see, like, an outcome, like, right away when you use it. But in a few weeks, I'm sure, like, I'm going to see a little bit, like, of a difference. But it actually did feel, like, a little better than when I usually get out of the shower and put something on. Um, so this, this, um, is good. So, again, John Frieda Frizzy's Leave-In Conditioner. Um, and all three of these products that I'm showing you, you can just get them at any drugstore. And the last product I got was the John Frieda Frizzy Sheer Solution. And it kind of helps with, like, frizz and making your hair look better. Like, um, and you just, when you get out of the shower, like the other product, um, when your hair is damp, you just put ten, uh, drops into your hand and work your hands together and then work it through your hair. And, um... It just, like, it, like, contains your hair and makes it a little less frizzy than usual, and I think it really works. So, the John Frieda Frizzy Sheer Solution. And it's, like, it's not, like, a gel. It's not, like, a thick, um, it's not really thick. It's more, like, a water substance, but it just looks thick, but it's really not. And it's, like, a purple. It looks more pink in the camera. And then, after that, um, on Saturday, I went to Bath & Body Works. And the first thing I got was I needed a new plug-in because I've been have I have the same plug-in since December and it is the Twisted Peppermint. Um, so I needed a new one because I wanted all new spring scents. So I got the because if you saw my last two videos, you would see that I got the Tiki Beach candle. So I also wanted a plug-in the same scent. So I got the Tiki Beach plug-in and I, er I already had this from CV. Oh, CVS, what are you talking about? Um, from Bath and Body, this little flower plug-in thing. But I needed a new scent, so I got Tiki Beach. And then the next thing I got was, um, was this really cool, um, it's like a, sh it's called Shimmer and Shay, um, cause what happened was they said that if you buy a signature scent, you get a lotion and a bag free, so, um, my mom would let me get a signature scent, and it is the Paris Amore scent, Shimmer and Shay, but what it is, is, um, it is really cool, if you see, like, half is, like, shimmer, and half is lotion, and when you turn the cap more to the lotion side, you get shimmer. If you turn it to the middle, you get like a mixture of both, and if you turn it to the shimmer side, you get lotion, and I thought this was really cool, um, and I'll demonstrate for you, because I already put some on today, but I'll do a demonstration. If you see when I pump it out, it has like, I don't know if you guys can see that, but it ha it's like half a light pink, half white, because it comes out both, and then like you can also just do like all shimmer, all lotion, and if you don't know what shimmer, well, I'm sure you know what lotion is, but if you don't know what shimmer is, it's just like if you put it on you and it makes you sparkle, and I actually put it on earlier today, but it kind of wore off, because I, you know, went to school, so it kind of came off, but, um, it is really cool, and I love this, so again, the shimmer and shine, and this is in Paris some more, 
from Bath and Body. And the next thing I got was because I have a bunny and like I keep him in my room. If you can see, that's his cage down there. So um, I like take care of him in my room. Sorry, I'm just trying to like balance this again. Um, so I take care of him in my room, and sometimes, like, his cage smells a little, which is really gross because it's in my room. So, um, it's, like, annoying to clean the whole cage, like, every day. So I didn't want to keep, I didn't want to do that. So instead what I did was I got these, um, from Bath and Body, and they work really well, the room fragrances they're called. And I got them in three scents, Tiki Beach, Twilight Woods, and Lilac Blossom. And all you do is spray them in your room, and it literally... Um, not only did it overcome the scent of my bunny, but it also, like, also you can actually smell it. Like, my mom comes and she tells me my room smells really good because I use these. Um, and they work really well. So even if you don't have, like, a bad or smell in your room, it just helps your room smell good. Like, it has that extra smell. Like, people come in and they're like, wow, what is that? So, I'll quickly tell you what they smell like. The first one is Twilight Woods. Um, and it's a light pink. And this smells like kind of like a cologne for women. So it's like a sweet uh, version of a cologne. And it smells really good. So that is Twilight Woods. And that's for more of like a relaxed scent. If you want more of spring scents, um, more like upbeat, I guess you would call them. I got two. Um, like again, I have a third uh, thing um, in Tiki Beach. And I explained this in my last video, but Tiki Beach smells like... It's really sweet and a beach, like really like sugary, but also has that beach scent to it, and it's really good, and I love this one. So Tiki Beach, and that's an orange, and then the last one I got was in the scent Lilac Blossom, and it smells like a flower, and like um when you do your laundry, like you know like that lavender um like laundry detergent, like I don't know like that always makes me think of laundry whenever I smell lavender. I don't know, that's just me, but it kind of smells like lavender detergent and flowers mixed together. And it's a really good, too. I loved all of them. And there were so many scents. You guys can, like, there's so many different choices. So, again, that is Lilac Blas Blossom. And that's, like, a purple, but it has a little bit of pink in it. Um, and then, and then, I meant to say. Um, and then, like I said, when you get a signature scent there, there was, like, a special deal. Then you get a free lotion in a bag. So, the free lotion I got was Malibu Heat. And it kind of smells like if you went to Malibu, and that's what it would smell like. Like the beach, and like ocean, and all that stuff, like summer things. It makes you kind of smell like summer. So that's Malibu heat. And then they also gave us a free bag, which kind of looks like one of those shopping bags. I don't know if I'm going to use this. My mom might, like, use it, but I don't know if I'm going to. It just has, like, flowers and, like, fruit on it. I don't know. But it's cute, and it's just, like, a little bag. So those are the two free things I got with my purchases. Um, and now I will get to what's in my school purse video. So my purse is by Nine West, and it is from Macy's, and it has, like, a little belt going around the whole thing, and it is pink, as you could tell, and it has, like, little, like, like stud things here, and then these are, like, the handles of it, and it has this really adorable belt, and, like, with a little buckle, and then it says, oh, sorry, and it says Nine West on this. And then there's, like, no pockets or anything on the sides, just the belt that goes on the sides of it. And now I get to what's in my purse. And I know it's kind of, like, filled. Usually I'll carry my binder and then put my bag on my shoulder, but I just put everything in here for now. So the first thing I have is just a regular binder. Kind of boring. I don't think you guys really care about that. The next thing um, is a school folder, and it just says, take a free ride because you only live once. Bottom. And I thought that was just a cute little folder, and I put all my homework in this folder. The next thing is I have a little thing to write down my homework. Now, sometimes I'll write it in my school agenda, which my school gives us, but I sometimes will use this I have in my bag. And it's, like, just regular lined pages, and then I'll just jot down homework in it. And it just says live, laugh, love, and I like it. It's green, and it has lots of different colors on it. Here. And that is just, I'm not sure where I got this. I actually got it as a Hanukkah present like a year ago or like two years ago. And did it get really dark in here? It looks really dark in here. I don't know. Don't mind the lighting. This is really bad doing my laptop. But um, I got it for like a present. So I'm not sure where my parents got it from. But I mean, you can find one of these little notebook agenda things anywhere. It's not really agenda. It's just like a notebook, like a journal. 
So you can find one anywhere, really. Or just take a piece of paper and write it down. But, it, like, make sure to write your homework down. Because I know kids who don't, and they never remember to do their homework. As much as they say they're going to remember, it doesn't really work. The next thing I have is my Juicy Couture wallet, which I got from my friends for my birthday. And in it, I just have, you know, like, money, change. I have a wet seal gift card that I just got. Um, just some kind of, like, stuff if I ever need like any extra lunch money I try not to bring this to school with me because I, I bring lunch every day and um, I just bring it like sometimes I'll just bring it just in case like if it's a Friday and I want to get a snack like if I'm staying after school or something like with my friends to see like a game or something but um I usually try not to bring because I know people are always asking me to borrow money and if I don't have my wallet then I can tell them that I don't have my wallet and I can't lend them money um so it's kind of like an excuse but it's like real that you don't have it so just a wallet um, the next thing I have, which I know is kind of personal, it's a feminine thing that we need. Um, and I know it's kind of out in the open. Uh, actually, you guys can't see my bag, but it's kind of out in the open right now. Um, usually I'll put it, like, somewhere, but I just took it out now just to be easier to show you guys. It's just a Pam. Um, I think every girl should keep one, even if you don't have yours, your, uh, period yet, just in case. Um, like, if you get it any day. I think it's always good. I usually keep, like, one or two with me, and then I'll have, like, a tampon just in case. Um, and if I ever need more, I'll just take um and then i have a pair of sunglasses i don't know like what company or what these are from they're just a uh, black pair and they have like a little studs like uh bedazzled little jewels on the side yeah so just sunglasses in case i ever go outside or something and i need them it's really bright out um and then i have my phone oh my friend texted me sorry um phone i know it's little it slides up it's a very cute little phone. <laughs> Nothing very, like, technologic. And then, um, my iPod, which I keep with my earphone dropped around it. And I, they're so cute. They're little Spongebobs. I thought they were adorable. My sister got it for me. I forgot if it was my birthday or a holiday, but I thought they were adorable. And I have a little bejeweled case that my friend got me. I know I like bejeweled things. But, um, just my iPod in case I ever want to listen to music. I'm not allowed to listen during classes, but, like, before classes or after classes on the way home I'll listen um, and then in this, here I know I'm not really showing you guys my whole bag. So that was, everything I just took out was from this section. There's like a side over here. And then in this little pocket, I'm going to take show you everything. So the first thing I have is a lip gloss. And this is from, I think, Bath and Body. And it's in the scent, scent, I think, I don't know. It's a lip gloss. I don't know if you would say scent. But in pink chiffon, it's just a little lip gloss in case I ever need to put it on. Because mine come off, came off. Because I don't... I use a different lip gloss. But, you know, like, it's kind of the same thing. They're pink and sparkly. So, um... I don't really have much makeup. Because I don't really reapply it during the day. Only if I really need to. Um, if I'm taking, like, pictures for school or something. So, I just keep them. This is just an eyeliner. Um, it is Infallible by L'Oreal Paris. Just a regular black eyeliner. That's the only makeup I really keep in my bag. The next thing is Secret Wonderland Lotion, which I know is a winter scent, but I just, like, keep it because I think it smells really good, and everyone, everyone always borrows a little bit of lotion from me. And just a mini bottle. Um, I probably should change it to, like, a spring scent now. It's spring. These are just my house keys, and I have all random things. This is from when I went to Hollywood. This is my rainbow key. This is Yoshi's head. I guess his body fell off. Not sure why. This is Mario. <laughs> Um, and this is from my friend. She got it for me. It says, friends are angels following you through life. And I forgot what company it's from, but she got it me for a holiday. And just has a, I don't, you guys can't see it, but it has a little picture of an angel and says words on the front. And then, um, yeah. So that's my key holder. Um, the next thing in here is, um, I keep a little hand sanitizer because that always comes handy in school. And it's in the scent Island Margarita from Bath and Body. I know I have a lot of things from Bath and Body. I love things that smell good. I always think smelling good is very important. Um, and then I just have, you guys don't really need to see this, but just two, oh, actually no, I'm, don't see this. There are two, uh, um, what are they called? I, not, they're not identity cards, because they're like, they're not like a license. Like, what are they called? Like, school things. I don't know. They carry around. I don't even need them, but I'm not going to show you guys them, but they're just little cards. That I keep here, and the last thing I have is a little purple mirror. Actually, not the last thing, I have one more thing. It's by Conair, and it's purple. It just opens up, and that's really it. And then, 
Actually, now the last thing I have in that little pocket is a perfume because, like I said, I always like smelling good, so I'll spray it if something smells bad or if I want to smell good. Um, and I always get compliments on this one. It smells amazing. So it's Viva La Juicy, and it's in, like, a hot pink, and it smells oh, so good. This perfume. I'm going to spray it now. Oh, it's amazing. Love this. I can't even describe it, like, what the scent is. It's just so good. You guys have to, like, try this one day. Or, like, if someone you know has it, so smell it. So good. I'm sorry. Um, so that was on this side of the bag where I had a little pocket and I put all my stuff. And then in the middle, like separating the bag, um, it's a little zipper pouch and I just keep some pens and pencils in here. I have a calculator. I don't know if you guys care about this, but a calculator. Um, what else do I have in here? Just some reinforcements. I don't think anyone ever keeps these sections neat where you put pencils and stuff. That's kind of a messy section for everyone to like just throw in everything. A sharpener. What else is in there? Um, like I said, reinforcements, some pens, pencils, um, a hole puncher, just some random, uh, like, school supplies, you know, that I put in this little middle section. And then on the left side of the bag over here, I just have a little Spanish dictionary. I just have this because in Spanish class, sometimes I don't know the words, so I think it's really, it's handy to have this. Um, just a little Webster's Spanish dictionary. And a regular dictionary I don't have because usually the only class I really need that in is English and she, my teacher already has one in the classroom. And then usually um, I'll always have a little purple index card holder, but that's actually my locker now because I didn't need to bring it home today. I'll like switch it and take it in and out. So that's in my school locker. And the last thing, well not the last thing, the last thing on the left like section is this glasses case and my glasses. Nothing really exciting there either. Just... Classes. I don't know, I just need them for, in class, I, whenever, I can never, like, read the board, um, like, I don't need them, like, when I'm walking around the hallway and stuff, because I don't really need to read the board in the hallway, but, um, in class, I'll need to read the board, so I, I wear these in class, um, and, let's see, and then also on the left side is these, there's, I don't know if you guys can see, there's two little pockets, this one and this one. So in this pocket, I just have tissues. I think it's always good to carry around tissues, even if you don't have a cold. Um, just, you know, to have them, if you, like, you have a runny nose or something, or if you need it, if you spill something, tissues are always good to have. Um, and I think we are at the last item in my bag. Hold on, I can't fit this back in. Okay, the last thing in my bag is... Um, Tic Tac. So I know a lot of people, they always have different things. Um, people have gum. People have, uh, like, the bigger mints. I don't like gum, personally, and I don't like mints either. The only thing I really love, I don't know if you guys heard that. That was a garbage can outside. But the only thing that I really love to have in school, like a little snack, is Tic Tacs in the wintergreen. And you, as you can tell, I'm almost done. I'm actually going to take one right now. Oh, or take three. I'm going to put them back. Um... But I love the winter green Tic Tacs. That's the only kind of, like, snacking thing I carry around with me. Um, so that is all I have in my purse. And again, it's Nine West bag. Um, so that is everything I have in my school purse. Like I said, I usually will just put on my shoulder and I'll carry around, like, my binder. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. And don't forget to come back next Thursday and to subscribe. Um, have a good day.